Are you trying to start a war? Yeah. Do it. What are you going to do? Um, so, obviously, Christian, we're going to go for an interview today. Um, any questions, though, before we start? And, and definitely nothing going on with that uh, corner then. <laughs> Ronnie, what the hell? Like, I hate you and I'm going. <laughs> Kristen Scott, a good friend of mine, or at least she was until this moment. You just fully cracked my phone. You fully just cracked your phone. I'm so sorry. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. What you just saw right there was the moment that Kristen Scott brutally destroyed my phone. She smacked it out of my hand and smashed it to smithereens. I decided that it was time I took my revenge, and so I devised a plan. Or at least, Bambino Becky, the creative mastermind that she is, devised the plan. Big thanks to my friend Becky for letting me jump in on her video idea. In fact, Becky really egged me on. You know, Big Ronnie is out here ruining lives and I'm here for it. Oh, that's right, Becky. That is exactly what I'm going to do here. Ruin lives. Okay, maybe not to that extent, but I'm just trying to make this as dramatic as possible. This was my plan. I sent a professional email asking Kristen to take part in an interview for a big online magazine. Offered her a bit of money and arranged a date and time for her to jump on a Zoom call with Tanya Kearns. Meet Tanya Kearns, senior reporter at a big online magazine, played by Adisha Sneed. I contacted a few friends and as a team, we came up with some pretty awkward questions to ask Kristen. The Zoom call takes place, and Joe King sits in to take notes. Meet Joe King, journalist assistant to Tanya Kearns, played by yours truly. As the questions get more and more awkward for Kristen, I turn on my camera and watch as Kristen sits there in shock. Hello. Right, so today is today. Today is the day. Today is the day that I finally get my revenge on Kristen Scott. So, I was feeling a little bit bad about this because uh, she told me that she was actually really sorry for smashing my phone. However, then she started to call me egghead. Now, I know I've shaved all my hair off and I may have some similarities to an egg. There is no need for the comments. To be honest, there's no need for the comments whatsoever. Um, so, Kristen Scott, I'm about to ruin your life. I can't wait. No, no. Okay, so there's a slight problem. Um, it looks like Adisha is going to be late. Oh, no, that's not fucking... Okay, I am going to need to send Kristen an email. What is an excuse I can give? I almost signed it, Ronnie. I almost signed it saying Ronnie. Um, I'm just gonna have to say that. Just gonna have to say that. So how are you all today? Good? Design this. Where's my fucking beanie? You're my friend, Ronnie. I love you. I love you. I love you. Scotland. Aye. Interviews. Ah! It's time. It is time. And so it begins. Um, okay. <laughs> good luck. Thanks. You okay today? I'm good. Yeah, how are you? Yeah. I'm very good, thank you. Um, so, obviously, Christian, we're going to go through an interview today. Um, any questions, though, before we start? No, no, no. Um, we've got... Is it filmed? No, it's not filmed. No, we've got Joe, uh, my assistant there, Joe King. He's going to be, if you can see, he's got no audio or camera. He's going to be taking notes as we go throughout. Okay, four. Yeah, right. Okay, and I'm just going to go ahead and just ask you some questions and then you'll just note it all down and edit all that for us later. Um, yeah, of sweet. course, brilliant. Um, so, first yeah, of all, 
Um, you're an active social media user since the age of uh, 12 years old, is that correct? Around yeah, so, uh huh, because I was like, using Musical.ly, but like I made my TikTok account like last year in May, so it's like mm. I had another account. And it's, like, yeah. 29, 29 million likes, that's amazing. How do you feel about having all those uh, followers? Um, oh, yeah, it's really cool. Oh, sorry, someone should call me. It's um, okay. Yeah, it, it's like, it's just, it's mad. Like, I didn't expect it to happen. Where do you think your popularity and your growth has actually come from, in your opinion? I feel like I gained most of it more like last year. Yeah. Because I had this like video that went viral. It had 10 million views and it was just like, mm. I had these two broken glasses and I like pretended I smashed them together, but they were already smashed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And like, mm -hmm. it was like a massive like trend. Like, the whole For You page at the time was just full of people duetting it, saying, oh my God, this is fake. Um, moving on from that, well, you were at Winter in the City as well at the end of last year. So word on the grapevine is that you suffered from um, a panic attack, I heard. Something to do with uh, losing your phone, but then found it later yeah. in your bag. I know this has happened to me plenty of yeah. times. Yeah. <laughs> but how do you feel about that experience? What happened there? Right, well, I was in, this is so embarrassing, I was in a mob of like people, because like, there was like people coming over getting pictures, and it was about, I say I was surrounded by about 35, 40 people at the time, and then I was like, where's my phone? And I just started like having a panic attack and then people were like filming me and obviously this is just making it worse. And I found it in my bag about five minutes later and I was like, oh my God, that's so embarrassing. Well, we did see you um, featured in a lot of um, blogs as well on that day. One particular caught a riot was um, a video with Ronnie Warwick um, entitled Christian Scott Broke My Phone. Can you tell us what happened there, <laughs> the story behind that? Oh, right. So I was on, like, Ronnie was vlogging. He got it in video. He was just, like, yeah. filming me. And I, like, he filmed, like, really close to my face. And, like, I pushed it back a bit. And he, just, he dropped his phone. And it just shattered. And it's still smashed to this day. And he's still like, annoyed <laughs> about it. But, like, we're, we're really good friends with him. But, yeah, I might have smashed his phone a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> um. A lot of our audience does want to look at um, a lot of edits with Connor Barrack. Is there anything going on there at all that you can tell us about? Any oh, sort of romance no. at all? Are you? <laughs> no, there's there's literally nothing. I don't know what what that was about. I mean, him are just like friends. There's nothing there at all. You sure? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure there's nothing. <laughs> Um, a throwback here then, you were in the Jimmy Savile tribute show 2011, <laughs> how, where that was probably, I, I suppose that was one of your first experiences there. Um, how did that well, go? How do you feel about that? Um, well, so obviously, so Jimmy Savile just died. There was no, nothing out about him being a paedophile at the time. So there was a tribute like saying, oh, like, it's sad that he's died because obviously we yeah. didn't know. And I was on the show. They found out two days later that he's a paedophile and yeah, my mum volunteered me because it was oh, like you make a wish and it's like mm. your dream would come true, that's kind of like the thing. Oh right, okay. Um, so my dream that... was to be a fairy when I was seven. Your, your dream is sorry? <laughs> my dream when I was younger at like seven was to be a fairy, so oh. I was a fairy. <laughs> <laughs> and, and definitely nothing going on with that corner then? <laughs> no, 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 no to say. I think it's time I reveal to Kristen who's really behind all of this. Uh, brilliant. Okay, um, just give me one second there. Just gonna make sure checking with Joe that he's got everything. Uh, just one second there. Thank you. Yeah, that all seems good. Um, thank you, Kristen. Wait, run! <laughs> Thanks, Kristen. Ronnie, what the hell? What are you doing? Did you not clock my name, Kristen? No. Joe King. Oh. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Kristen. No, you're not. This is not my idea. <laughs> no, you are not. Uh, I'm not. I'm not. It was quite fun. It was quite fun. Say hello <laughs> to know, the like subscribers this. of my YouTube channel. Hello, hello. So that isn't funny. That is not funny. <laughs> not. Ronnie. Wait, so who's Tanya Cairns? Oh, this not is... me. Um, I, I'm Dee. 
You are right. <laughs> I just stuck a pair of glasses on in a posh accent. Um, I was like, I, why is he bringing up why is Connor Berwick getting brought up? That's just a walk through. I know, the money, <laughs> asking you about the money all the time, the Connor Berwick thing, obviously, it's all Ronnie's ID, he gave me all the information. And this, Kristen, is what happens when you, sorry, can we just go back to uh, when you said that you pushed my phone away? I think you'll find in the video it would be more of a slap. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't want that on the website. Well, it's going to be on my YouTube channel. <laughs> again! Yeah. You're featuring Payback. <laughs> also, <laughs> Payback <laughs> calling me Egg. That's not funny, actually. I was so excited for this interview, right? My I mom feel so bad. Downstairs. I'm so sorry. I'm I feel massive. really bad. <laughs> and to make it even worse, Kristen, Everyone knew. I done my makeup for this. I, I done my makeup. <laughs> you do look lovely if it's any consolation. <laughs> Who knew about this? Um, most people. Right, I hate you, and I'm going. <laughs> Brilliant. A success. A job. Yeah, I do as well. <laughs> really, a complete mission done. It was good working with you, Dee. I was doing business with you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed the video. Kristen, I hope you enjoyed the interview. Kristen, you asked for this war. I've started it, and I am going to be the one to finish it. Once again, big thanks to Bambino Becky for letting me jump in on her video idea. Her video is linked down below in the description, so make sure that you go check it out. And thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you did enjoy, make sure that you drop a like, subscribe, and... What's it called? Turn on those post notifications. If you've got any video ideas that you want me to do, let me know down in the comments below. And uh, you may just see it on my channel. Thank you all so much for watching. And uh, I will see you next week with another video. Maybe. Don't know. Anything could happen. Love you all. Thanks for watching. And goodbye.